When people talk about life-changing events, I struggle to put my finger on what those might be for me. But I think I'll look back at my career in two parts now. The time before the 2023 European Saddlecross Championships and the time after it.
This racing experience was always going to be hard to get down into words, into a video and out into the world, but this is my best shot. This second place at the Elite European Saddlecross Championships feels like the hardest and the easiest achievement of my career in my life. It's the hardest because of all the time, effort, commitment and pain that went into getting here, but it's also the easiest because I couldn't imagine doing anything else with my life. This historic medal represents my belief, the people around me and where I'm going. The race was of course not perfect. The third row start, the lack of aggression and struggling on the first lap, the tactics of the second lap, but my ability to lock in, ride my own race and find the limits of the track allowed me to perform like this. As I started to push the pace of the chase group and distance my rivals, I was bridging towards Michael Van Turnout. All my team staff were shouting to commit and to believe. And that's what I set about doing, just like I have done all of my life riding and racing my bike. If you had told 14 year old Cameron, who watched every race dreaming of being at the front of the world stage, that he would be pushing for the win, fighting for medals and animating the race, he would have believed you. Because at no point have I ever set a limit for myself and that's not gonna change. I want to thank my mum, dad, family and friends for their unconditional support through everything. My coach Jimmy for his guidance, my team for their support and belief in me and my goals, and to all the supporters of me and Sattlecross for their love. And I'm not done yet.